Hi friends, welcome to today's video. My house needed a really good cleaning. I have been doing some home improvement projects. There are some paint cans there and some wallpaper on the floor because I wallpapered one of the walls. And so it needed a good cleaning here just in my living room, my dining room, and my kitchen. Over the course of this video, I will do a few more small improvements. So. Um, you can wait for that coming up a little bit later for now. I just have to kind of straighten up this mess. If you're new to this channel, welcome here and um, consider subscribing for more videos about minimalism, cleaning, organizing and healthy lifestyle. All right, let's dive deep here. As you can see the window on the right hand side it has a brown and silverish window frame and um, the other ones I already painted and I'm going to actually paint that one white oh, later on in the video it has been bothering me for such a long time the windows are actually quite good still I mean I live in a really old house but in Germany houses are built in a way that they really last and it's very sturdy that window frame has been bothering me and today was the time to really make it white and it made it look so much so much more clean so Next up is the dining room and as you can see I've already painted both of those window frames. It makes such a big difference to have them in white instead of that old brown. As I said before, over the course of the next few months and weeks, there will be more improvements to come. Next big project is the bathroom that will start in a couple of weeks and it will last for a little bit. So I don't know how many videos I'll be able to put out during the time that we are redoing the entire bathroom because I'll be helping quite a bit also. So I'll do my best. I'm sure I do need some cleaning during that time, but um, I mean, the house is probably going to be a little bit dirty anyway. Baby, I'm not mad at all. We both tried and tasted all. Can't hold our love against the wall. No. Every inch of me is hurting and I, I just want to leave it all behind. Yeah, I'm breaking up with you tonight. Yeah, you know.
even for this room for the dining room one of the windows will be turned into a door and we will actually build um, like a balcony right so that we can go outside from the back from the dining room probably that's gonna be a project for next year because this year we're taking on the bathroom that is really a big project and um, so I'm very excited then because right now when we want to go outside into our yard, we have to kind of we have to go downstairs and then go outside. And it's kind of annoying not to be able to access the yard from the dining room. It's going to be so nice to be able um, to go outside from the dining room and then probably it's going to be so much easier just to decide to just sit outside for a few minutes, even having a meal, even in winter sometimes when it's a really sunny day. It's going to be really nice to just say, oh, maybe I'll just sit outside for a few minutes here. As you can see, the kitchen is pretty messy. I, when I wallpapered the, the one wall in the living room, I put all the stuff that was on the wall in, on the kitchen counter and there was also like all kinds of other stuff in there from cooking and from just food and stuff that I had bought. And so, yeah, I did not want to hang up all the things again on the wall just because I like the white wall now. wondering what I'm doing there I'm actually talking to someone on the phone um, over my headphones <laughs> I'm not talking to myself but I was actually um, on a phone call I think I called my mom and so um, yeah she's been very affected by coronavirus also she actually has a store she's had it for 47 years and she had to close for a few weeks and she was very relieved after being able to open back up just recently just this past week so long I've been trying to get you out of my head oh yeah but somehow I always seem to wake up in your
videos almost 10 years ago, it looked so different. I might make a video one day, you know, when I, after I remodel a few more things that, you know, like after the bathroom probably, <laughs> then I have pretty much everything done. I'm gonna show you what it looked like before because it looked so different. Um, I put this kitchen in, there, there was walls that aren't there anymore, tons of walls. Uh, the kitchen and the living room and the dining room where it's at right now, um, that was, let me see, one, two, three, four, five rooms all together. And it looked so different. We opened up the walls, we put in um, horizontal beams to, you know, like, <laughs> to support the house um, instead of, you know, all kinds of beams, like left and right and up and down. And so I wanted that open space and I'm very happy with having that open kitchen going into the dining room and it was such small little rooms before. It looked so extremely different and there was carpet in the house and flooring that was like 50, 60 years old. It was insane. And even some of the curtains, they were 60s, I bet. I, I mean, I, really, I'm not kidding, 60s style. So I'm really, really proud of what I have been doing to the house. I went by your house, what a big mistake. very dirty it needed a cleaning I had cleaned almost all the other windows and that one was really dirty and I absolutely can recommend one of those that I have here one of those squeegee vacuum or vacuum squeegees you squeegee off the dirty stuff and the, the, the moisture the water I just wipe down and I spray the window and then I just vacuum it off with a squeegee. That means there's no dirty water dripping anywhere. I can highly recommend those. Without any thought, I keep moving on. I don't even care if my soul is gone. So many All right, another project, which you only see a part of, we mounted the TV onto the wall with a um, with a mount that you can really swivel it to the left and to the right really far, and so we can watch TV then from the living room, from the couch, or from the dining room table, which is really cool. So we got rid of that stand, and there it is. <laughs> um, after we drilled the holes, it was kind of a pain. It took about an hour, and and I had this little fireplace um, thing, that little mantle, it's just a, de a decor thing, but um, I picked it up. I'm still gonna maybe try to do something to the cables, doesn't look nice, but I think it's so much more practical now. We, I don't really watch DVDs anymore, we only do streaming, we have Netflix and Amazon Prime. And maybe, you know, you could watch YouTube on television. So I think there's enough entertainment. We don't really need a DVD player anymore. We have not been using it, so I got rid of all of our DVDs. And now the TV mounted to the wall. I feel like it's not that center of, you know, taking up all that space, that floor space, that real estate. I think on the wall it looks just so much more elegant. And plus, it's nicer to watch when it's kind of further up. I absolutely love it. It was really, really dirty because when it's down there, it's like, I don't know, kids touch it and stuff. So hanging it up really keeps it away from like the action and I really like it. I used to think I had plenty. And the last big project for the day was First of all, cleaning the window frame, that dirty, nasty, ugly, old, brown window frame there. I clean it up, sand it off just a bit, and 
well then I started painting it white wallpapering that wall also that's why I didn't um, tape didn't put any tape on um, it was okay to not be you know that accurate on the edges because I'm gonna wallpaper that wall I haven't decided yet if I'm gonna do it white or maybe like a pattern or something I have the other wall in white but I think maybe it could be kind of an accent wall nothing crazy but just maybe something just a little bit of pattern and four coats and five hours later it looks so much better I think it does um, let me know if you also think white looks so much better so I think it just gives the whole room a different a whole different style with the white window frames versus the brown ones so thank you for watching have a most wonderful day now the last thing I'm gonna do here is vacuum so I'm just gonna let the music play subscribe if you have not if you want to come back Stay healthy, stay safe, and uh, keep on cleaning that house and do small projects. Bye. Far away from the